This is a short presentation on how to assemble a graph rainwater harvesting system. The graph rainwater harvesting system is delivered directly to site by Reese Direct. This eliminates any manual handling by our branches and also frees up resources. Delivery is also free with the graph system anywhere in Australia. The graph system comes tightly packed with all the components inside the tank. First of all, remove and dispose of any packaging. Secondly, check your components, dome caps or plugs, inlet and outlet dome seals, lifting lugs, liquid soap, quick connectors, plastic loading pins, lid profile seal and tank dome seal, tank profile seal and installation instructions. Pull the top half of the tank out and leave it close to your hole. Now position the bottom half of the tank next to the hole. Pick up the tank profile seal. Insert the seal into the bottom half of the tank. You can now insert the plastic loading pins into the holes around the tank. There may be a couple left over. Pick up the inlet and outlet dome seals. These need to be installed from the outside in. There are exceptions, refer to installation instructions. For example, when installing a Minimax filter, hole number one needs to be inserted from inside out. Cap off unused holes with caps provided. You can now grab the lid profile seal. Push this into position on the top of a dome. You can use a rubber mallet to finish this off. Turn over the top half of the tank. It is now time to attach the dome. For this you will need the tank dome seal. Push the tank dome seal into position on the top half of the tank. You can use a rubber mallet to finish this off. Smear liquid soap to the inside of a tank dome seal. Place the tank dome to the top of the tank. Apply some pressure to the dome and it will lock into place. Use the mullet to lock the two lifting lugs into position. Smear liquid soap all over the tank profile seal. You can now position the top half to the bottom half of your tank. Pick up the quick connectors. Connect every second connector working your way clockwise with a rubber mallet. Once completed, work your way the other way anti-clockwise. You can now use your excavator to lower the tank into the hole. It is now time to install the filter. Check first that you have all the components. Filter body, filter cartridge, inflow and outflow adapters, span fix fixing collars, overflow siphon, 
inlet stilling pot, spray cleaner. Pick up your filter body, cartridge and spray cleaner. Install the spray cleaner into the hole provided in the side of a filter. Install the filter cartridge into the filter body, making sure it is flowing the right way. Lock the lid into position. Pick up the overflow siphon. Work the overflow siphon into hole number one. Pick up the inflow and the outflow pipe adapters. Apply lubricant to the required dome seals. Work the adapters into the required holes. Use the filter as a guide to adjust the inflow and outflow pipe adapters. Pick up a piece of 100mm DWV. Refer to installation instructions for length of pipe and add 100mm. Make sure you measure from bell end. Pick up stilling pot and DWV. Insert DWV into stilling pot. Drive a rust proof screw into each side. Place stilling pot into the tank. Pick up span fix fixing collars. Place these over adapters. Insert filter into DWV. Fix filter to adapters with the span fix fixing collars. Repeat on other side. Lubricate lid seal. Work telescopic lid and shaft into dome. You're able to access the tank through the lid. Use a socket set to secure the lid. Tank is now assembled.